That's the one thing that I find a lot of times. I'll be playing a game, like I'll be playing a demo, and there sometimes there the exit to exit the game is not as easy to find as you would think. Next is one Phoenix Down. Now this game is developed by Regal Craft Games. A retro-inspired classic turn-based RPG for those nostalgic for the 90s golden era. Explore a vast world with 14 playable characters, fight hundreds of unique enemies, and delve into an epic story of war, betrayal, and redemption. Again, single player, it's it's a squad-based uh, JRPG, so of course it would be. And developed and published by Regal Craft Games. And let me just put the link in chat. I played this a little bit. Again, just to make sure that it would work for streaming. So, we're using gamepad, so action, cancel, menu, and walk or status. Okay, cool. Westwatch Fortress. I don't really know how to pronounce that name. So, uh, Chichioku? Chichioku? Yeah, I'm gonna go with that. It would appear that it was nothing but mere gossip. And he's like a wolf man. Yet still, who would spend tales of a hooded traveler seeking the spirit stones? Perhaps another round of reconnaissance is in... We're under attack! Sound the alarm! What? And they're being attacked by lizard things. How foolish. Who would be so brazen as to attack the Torlorian kingdom? We'll soon find out. I have no love for these humans. But I cannot allow their deaths to hinder my investigation. Okay, we can control now. I'm still playing around with the music levels here, so if there's an issue, please let me know. That's one thing I noticed. That so the movement is a little bit <laughs> very fast. So... What's this? This leads into the castle, but first I must confront the aggressors. Okay. This sounds like something from Star Wars. This... Or maybe it's my imagination. So climbing down... on the wall. Okay. I'll lower this again. Chichioku got the upper hand. So he's got his two swords and he's going up against Lizard Dude. Chichioku can study an enemy's weakness and exploit it with his elemental throwing stars. Alternatively, his ninjutsu skill packs a punch but some require precise timing to execute. How you best utilize his abilities is your choice. Good luck, player. <laughs> well, let's see. Let's study our opponent. Doesn't look like it uses anything, so. Dracokin. So it's HP is 365. Wow, it's as high as mine. Power 88, Spirit 64, Defense 61, Resistance, Agility, SP. Weakness is Aqua. Resist Air. Oh, he's resistant to Metal? And Earth, or Nature. Hmm. So what happens if we throw... Oh, that's uh, it's for multiple enemies, but let's see. Alright. 
So I guess it pays to use their weaknesses. Oh, he's level 40. Yeah, run, little bitches. Hmm. It appears the cowardly brigands fled south to the human village. So, these guys are, these guys are all dead. Yeah. Oh. A Dracokin. Donning the Goan, go, oh boy, I have to figure out how to say that. The Goan white and gold? go and oh. This does not bode well. Elixir, and so we picked up, what did we pick up? We picked up, what do we have? Mega Potion, heals an ally for a moderate amount of HP. Panacea, cures a single ally of negative status effects, does not affect stat debuffs. Shuriken, Aqua Edge, an elemental throwing star utilized by ninjas. So we have a limited number of those. Elixir fully heals an ally's HP and SP, and Ether recovers a small amount of SP for one ally. Okay. What about his equipment? What's he got? Two Tontos, hard leather helmet, hard leather body armor, mysterious tonic. What's that? A seemingly endless substance that enhances the user's physical capabilities at the expense of their spiritual ones. What does it do to his stats? Nothing. Or, wait. Removing it would remove 50 HP. It would double his SP. Lower his power, lower his defense. Increase his spirit, increase his resistance. And slightly lower his agility. Okay, so let's leave that. Alright, so south, he said, right? Is there anything else around here worth exploring? Okay. Nope. Oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Ooh. This does not look like an even fight. This is no mere bandit raid. What madness have I stumbled upon? If I can take out the enemy commander, perhaps I might thwart their aggression and cause a hasty retreat. So we got a plan. During this event, the action button will allow Chichioku to instantly dispatch nearby enemies. If they touch him for too long, however, a battle will occur. Interesting. So that's a way of quickly getting through without being bogged down by fights. Hmm. So, okay. Oh, that's how that works. Okay. I can't attack those guys for some reason because they're engaged in a fight. Those guys are quick. Oh, hello. Found Nadachi. Can I... I'm assuming I can equip that. Right on. Yeah, let's, let's go with that. Oh, there's another chest. Atma Shuriken. What is that? Throwing star utilized by adept ninjas to strike their opponents from afar. This ultimate model deals significant damage to a foe. Alright. Good to know. So, where am I going? Well, there's an indicator right there. Mm -hmm. da -da -da -da. 
Okay, so what do we want to do? Let's see what other abilities he's got. Summons a mist to shroud his appearance, granting 100% evasion to physical attacks for two turns. Chichioku gains the element of surprise, increasing critical... <clears throat> increasing critical hit rate and critical damage. And he uses soul points, though. Combo. Heavy non-elemental damage that attempts to stagger an enemy. Chichioku's omnidirectional attack penetrates through shields and protective barriers. Attack and quickly follow up with another action. Chichioku attacks so swiftly that enemies have no opportunity to counter. Sweet. Uh, breathe. Uh, Dragon Breath nukes an enemy for heavy Ignis and Umbra damage. I'm guessing Umbra is like shadow damage. Uh, unleashes a series of deep gashes to the enemy's sides, causing bleeding. If the enemy is already bleeding, it will be critical hit and afflicted with hemorrhaging. Ooh. Well, let's try this. I don't know what it does. Let's see what, how... Oh, shit. Oh, I didn't realize I had to do that. Okay. What a status effect was that? Let's just tr try a conventional attack first. Let's see how that does. Hmm. He's got barrier, but it looks like he's bleeding. So, wait, hang on a second. Let's try this. Uh, which one was it? So this one? Let's see if we can make him hemorrhage. Okay, there we go. Oh, I don't think it matters. He's pretty dead. <laughs> it appears quiet on this side. I doubt the enemy commander is over here. Oh, someone's still alive. Still alive? The spirits bless you. Please, spare me, beast man. Do I appear to be one of those Dracokin brigands, human? No, I guess not. What's your name, soldier? Ardus, sir. Do you still have the wits to fight? Actually, we, we were going to warn the capital of the attack before... before... A courier. Best you run along, then. Don't let me keep you waiting. Yes, thank you. What's this? You can now swap between Chichioku and Artis. Oh. Press and hold the shift sprint key to activate a swap. Auto sprint will be enabled for the rest of the event. To continue the story, move both characters to their respective waypoints. Hint, you may need to swap between the two to help each other reach their final destination. Uh, interesting. So, to swap is square. Okay. So this guy... Oh, jeez. He's level 5, he's got 74 HP. Uh-huh. I don't really want to get into a fight with this guy. Wait, what did that say at the bottom? I need to escape and warn the king. Do I have to fight him, or am I supposed to just avoid? Oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Oh. Oh, there's a chest. But I can't get to it from here? Why? Because that little wall. Okay. How do I get around that? I don't... doesn't look like I can from this side. Yeah. That's weird. So... Where do I want to go? I'm a little stuck here. There we go. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, am I trapped? Can't see me. 
Oof. Yeah, I really, uh, I don't think I'm supposed to get into a fight with this guy. I think I'm supposed to just run away from everything. Uh-huh. Shit. I thought I could sneak by him. And press the X cancel button during action selection in combat to view extra party commands, including escape. Ow. What was it? Ah. Okay, so we're not going to go that way. Or we just have to hide amongst trees. Oh, wait, here we go. Are you kidding me? I'm not going to try and say that because I don't know what that is. Hmm. Thank Matthias. I didn't think they saw me. We we'll need to find a different way out of town. The woods to the north look quiet. Uh, oh shit. Oh shit. Uh. This is... Maybe this way? Oh. Oh, I can't... Oh, fuck, I can't reach that. Well, why is there a circle here? What's this? Huh? What's a boat doing up here? There was a... There was a... A waypoint at this boat, and there was a waypoint at that dock. I wonder if that's related. I might be able to escape with this. I don't think that's going to work, but that's... You can jump in after it. Wait, come back. This guy's not very bright. Dive in after it. Oh, I should have planned that better. Time to look for another escape path. Or wait a second. They did say that... Oh, I wonder if uh, Chijioku's supposed to use that. Oh, shoot. No, can't go that way. I do like the music a lot. Hmm. I don't know how to get to that chest, but so let's just focus on getting this guy out of here. Should be safe here to catch my breath. I wonder how the beast man is doing. Oh, are we gonna switch? No. Okay. So Beast Man is exactly where we left him. Is this? Oh, wait. Oh! oh yeah, so the boat was for him. Well, that's lucky. Can't go that way. What? Oh. Just looking for any goods. Well, I don't see any. There was a guy over here that looked important. That red dude in the bottom left-hand corner. Is that the commander? How am I supposed to get to him?
I don't think I can. Maybe that's... Maybe I need to get to that boat. Maybe that's the next part. Let's see. Hmm. Unexpectedly convenient. I can reach the western shore with this. Oh, okay, so that is what he needs. Uh, no, not yet. Because I see something. Ah, okay. Found eagle eye. What is this? Oh, wait a second. I wonder if that other chest is meant for him. Protective eyewear increases the user's hit rate by 20% and provides immunity to blind. Sign me up, man. Let's, let's go see as quickly as we can. If I can reach that other... Uh, no, I can't. Oh, well, that's nice. Two potions. Nothing to sneeze at. Hey, Corpo, how's it going, man? Playing this, uh, an, an indie game called... One Phoenix down. And I'm really digging it so far. Oh, yeah, okay, so I can get to that chest. Gradius. Characters can learn skills in passives by spending CP. Open the menu and select skills. Scroll down to learn skills to teach Chichioku dagger proficiency. Alright. This is... Have you seen this game at all? Wait, where did it say? Status. <laughs> Unrealistically good. It's called One Phoenix Down with, uh, uh, Phoenix is spelled with an F. Or is it skill? Oh, wait. Skill? Learn skills. Here we go. Dagger proficiency. Sure. So now he knows how to use daggers. I don't think we have any, but whatever. So let's go to that boat. One Phoenix Down developed by Regal Craft Games. Not heard of One Phoenix Down or Webbing Journey, so probably you know. I just finished playing uh, a Webbing Journey, and it's it's kind of cute. <laughs> it's a lot of fun, actually. Oh, come on, Nightbot. What did it say? Stop spamming caps? Oh. Ah. oh, the phoenix down? Yeah. But it's, um... It's already kind of like... Oh, wait, did I not... Board the boat, you won't be able to return. Yes. Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button, that's why. I always fight with interfaces. There we go. It's um, it's it's kind of grounded. Like, cause you start off with basically people just like townspeople just getting murdered by an invading force. I'm like, oh, that's a that's a neat way to start. Just kind of throws you into it. I hear voices nearby. I should listen here. Hmm. I wonder how that courier is faring. So we can actually swap between two different characters. There's a... Where is he? Oh, there he is. So this was a courier that was almost killed, and he was running to the capital to warn the king of the invasion. So you actually control both of them switching back and forth. But you have to free up a boat for Wolfman so that he can get to the other shore. And now I think... I hope... We can just leave now. Beastman's fine. What? Okay, so let's switch back. What? Oh. All right. Oh, because I wasn't standing on the exact spot. All right, it looks like the way is clear. I should be able to make it to the capital. 
I hope that kind beast man makes it out okay. Well, he didn't exactly introduce himself, so Beast Man seems appropriate. Oh, interesting. So, before, when you were controlling the courier, you couldn't understand what these Dracokin were saying to each other. But I guess Wolfman can. Planet of the Apes movie started that way. Like, the original one? I haven't seen the original one, actually. I should get my wife to watch it with me. Why haven't we taken their fort yet? The humans are putting up more resistance than... Crush them! No excuses! Oh, he's cross. That must be the enemy commander. Time to end this senseless bloodshed. Oh! <laughs> he's elite. Most recent one, I think, just a raid with everybody dying. Oh, the the what was it? The latest one called a king, the kingdom of the planet of the apes, I think. I think, yeah, I haven't seen I haven't seen anyone since the original one with, um, well, the original remade one with I think, I want to say Mark Wahlberg, which is such a weird fit. What are you? doing, Lupo Man? Why'd you attack your brethren? Oh, so they're... Hmm. They're brethren. Hmm. This one is giving us trouble on the battlefield. We got us a human lover. Is that it? You feeling some kinship with these dregs, Lupo Man? Do not mistake my intentions. I care not for them. But I need your Dracokin gone. <laughs> but the fun has only begun. The Emperor has great plans for this land. Alright. The Emperor. So it is a declaration of war from the Goa Empire. Just as I feared. My rig is not the rig of my dreams. <laughs> well, neither is mine. I'm... Half, uh, so, I'm halfway through building a new one, and I made the mistake of getting an Intel 13th Gen ship. Which I'm not particularly happy about, because it's out of the window for me to be able to return it. So I just have to make do, and hopefully it won't rust from the inside. Thanks, Ben. I really do appreciate it. Alright, let's see where we go from here. Enough talk. Let's see what you're made of, human lover. Stay back. This one's mine. Ooh, oh, I love that. I love that whenever there's a... Whenever you watch a movie, it's like, no, don't fight him. This one's mine. Mano a mano. To the death. Right on. Autosave occurs before difficult boss battles and after long cutscenes to avoid needing to rewatch the same scene repeatedly. That's very considerate, actually. It also tells me that there's a good chance I may not win this fight. <laughs> Ooh. Alright, let's study this fella first. Butterfly. Ow! Holy crap! He's got 1840 HP. I wonder if I'm even meant to win this fight. Power, oof, really high. Weakness to Aqua and Holy, which I don't have any Holy, but I do have Aqua. All right. Well, let's uh, let's just hit him. Let's see how much damage we do to him. Stock. <laughs> huh. That's a staggering enemy. Let's try this. So, I have to remember there's a key sequence for this. There we go. Nice. Did that do holy damage to him?
Oh, I'm hemorrhaging. Oh, shit. Item. Uh, let's use a mega potion. Um. Yeah. Let's let's make him bleed. Holy shit! Uh huh. Oh, this guy it's a wallop. Yeah, let's uh let's fully heal here. What's this Exedo? Is it like a limit break? Deals massive shadow damage and attempts to pull enemies through death's door. If an enemy would survive the deadly dance with less than 30 HP, it dies. Sweet. I don't think that's happening, but let's see what it does. That's it? That didn't really do a lot. Huh. Your full heal heals 2k and he's got like 1.8k. I don't know. If you're meant to beat this guy, it was a it was an item that I used. It was um, oh what was it, an elixir or something like that that did uh, restored full HP and and SP. All right, oops, let's use this again because he's already bleeding, so this will cause him to hemorrhage. I'm just hoping that. That wasn't a mistake, and I hope he doesn't wipe me out in the next... Oh, shit. This guy is fucking strong. Holy shit. Oh, shit. You know what? Why not? Wait a minute, he has a weakness to Aqua, right? Let's try that. Oh, he's dead. We got him. Whew. I don't like that I used two elixirs for this guy. We got Berserker Gloves. Thousand... Argente, which I'm guessing is the currency. 6,500 experience. Whoa. Class points. Oh, right. Because class points allow you to learn new abilities. All right. Dead. Protect the Blood Prince. Blood Prince. Nice. I would expect the ninja to do that. Was that truly Blood Prince Vorth I slew? Spirits curse me. I've only made the situation worse. How? Oh, I guess we'll find out. I must report this unfortunate turn of events to the elders. Huh. That's interesting. Blood Prince, you must rest. Where do I look so weak? Prepare the soul ritual at once. But your body will... At once. What's the blood ritual do? Is this like a... I don't know. <laughs> oh, okay. Huh. I don't think we're we've seen the last of him. That 
that must be the courier. Well, RC done, I like your game so far. I love these style of of retro. Of the, I love that look, like the Overland map, and like the Final Fantasies, Chrono Trigger, and all that. And this looks like the market scene from Chrono Trigger. Actually, it just reminds me of it. Fulka and Yu Namakoshi on music. Excellent job. You know, that's really good visual storytelling. Over the credits, I really like how they did that. You have an idea of what's going on and they didn't use any dialogue. Although, I'm thinking now, if, we, <laughs> if I really wanted to, I could just take that scene where the, the guy goes into the castle, the courier goes into the castle and tells everybody, and they all have the exclamation marks over their head, and everybody starts running. And I could just do voiceover and say, peace is here, and then everybody gets excited and starts running out the door. <laughs> Maybe if I'm bored, and if I have time, I will. Time is always the factor. Field Marshal Strauss. Now let's give this guy a voice. He's a field marshal, so he's got to have a, a bigly commanding voice. Captains, I thank you for gathering here on such short notice. Have we truly lost so much ground, old friend? Indeed. It appears we are up against the full might of the Goa Empire. Should we lose this choke point, we'll soon be fighting their horde on the streets of the capital. Ah, Matthias, have mercy. Field Marshal, sir. Surely we have the means to keep them at bay. I have a plan in the works, Captain. The Western Battalions need only hold the line while we set up our surprises for the enemy. Aye. I saw it as I arrived, amassing all of the mining dynamite from our hometown. Clever move. Should be enough to afford us time. After that, we can... Field Marshal, sir! Our forces have been routed. The enemy approaches. Damnation already? Gah. I had hoped for more time. Frank. Don't worry, Jan. Leave this to me. Thank you. But before you depart, allow me to strengthen your ranks. Julian. Martin. You've grown cold, old friend. How can you call upon your own sons like this? Oh. Is it... Should I call him Yan or Jan? I'm going to call him Yan, actually. I feel like Yan is better. Forget it, Yan. These boys are too green and will only get in our way. Fine. Julian, you'll be my eyes in the field. Follow Frank and return to me if the tide turns. Sir! Martin, fly south at once. Inform our reinforcements to make haste. That's an order, soldier. Sir. The rest of you, support Captain Frank and the reserve soldiers installing the enemy. We absolutely cannot fail here. Our nation hangs in the balance of this moment. Godspeed. All of you. Um, who am I controlling? There's a chest. Can I do anything with that? Nope. Can I talk to people? If our town falls like Dunrick, I don't know what I would do. They ask us to flee, but I believe in our soldiers. Wow, loyal citizens. Okay. So who am I controlling? I'm controlling Frank, Claire, and Winstrom. Okay. Good to know. Thank you for saving. Ah, thank you for taking up your sword again. 
I'm relying on you, old friend. Sir. Good luck, Captain. All right. The Mighty. Now that's a title. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, well, we got lightning. It's kind of neat. Almost done setting the explosive, sir. So they're going to blow the bridge. Oh, man. I mean, you're, you're operating on like a 16-bit atmosphere, but you were pulling out all the stops. You've got the weather effects, you've got the lightning and the music. Oh, man. I am feeling this. This is... Damnable rain. At a time like this, no less. Fear blessed, Winstrom. The heavens weep for our enemies' losses. Balderdash. The heavens piss on our grave of misfortune. But alas, it is a good day to die, gentlemen. What about the lady? Oh. <laughs> Ahem. And gentle lady. That'll do, old man. Oh, don't call... Old man! <laughs> the nerve of the youth! Steady, everyone. Focus. Here they come. That's a lot. Shields up. Hold formation. Do not allow the enemy to pass. Oh, shit. Okay, so rush. Oops. Oh, so right off the bat, without doing anything special, you can attack with multiple... You can attack multiple enemies with this dude. Right on. Let's see what that does. And she can only do one at a time. Let's just see what their base attacks do. He's got Thunderclap. Alright, let's just see. Kind of weak. Uh, oh, so he's got other abilities here. Frank inspires allies, increasing their maximum HP for three turns and healing minor wounds. That's handy. Orders allies to increase all physical damage and gain 20% lifesteal for three turns. Sweet. Orders allies to raise defenses and block the next physical attack in three turns. Let's do no quarter. And she's got fencing. Wait a minute. She's got fencing, but she's carrying a spear? Okay. Claire prepares a fierce counterattack to the next physical attack she receives. Increases evasion rate by 25%. Consider the enemy strategy placing all allies into guard. Huh. So she can place other allies into guard without them having to do so. That's not bad. Claire charges and thrushes her thrusts her spear into an enemy, pinning them for one turn. Ooh, let's do that to this dude. And... Thunderclap. Oh, that's it. Okay. So he's pinned. That's what that status symbol means. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Okay. Let's do this again. Let's try that. And thunderclap again from this dude. Oh, they're both pinned. You know what? Let's heal some minor wounds while they're pinned. And 
with Thunderclap again, since there's no restrictions on how much I can use this for some strange reason. Fuck that, man. I'm just gonna have my man Thor here doing everything. Keep it up, lads. Teach these bloody beasts may never to step foot in our lands again. What the hell is that? Whoa. <laughs> what in the hells is that thing? Oh. This is Vorth. This is... So this is what the blood ritual did to him? How the hell does that work? And doesn't he have to pay a price for that in some way? Like he's gonna die eventually? But... I don't know. I'm so confused. All right. All right. Now he's, uh, he looks strong. Sorry, Vorth, but you won't live long enough to take your father's seat. Now, I feel like this is an unwinnable fight. Let's, uh, yeah, let's get ready to defend. That's... Alright. Wish I had some idea of how much HP he had. <laughs> oh wow, okay. Oh shoot. Uh, I might as well do that. Fucking hell. What is this strength? Yeah, that was <laughs> holy crap. <laughs> Weak. Oh, he's just walking away. Oh, it's dude's son. Here, it's my last potion. Please use it. Uh, I think it broke half my ribs in one swing. How can we fight such a beast? Julian, get to your father immediately. He must. Destroy the bridge now. Yes, sir. Quickly, soldiers. Retreat to th the bridge. Oh, no. Claire? Winstrom! Oh, shit. Rest well, my friends. Uh oh. Julian, I'm coming. Oh, we're in control. Julian! You bastards. Take this. Julian, are you... Frank, my legs. Can't feel my legs. Thank Matthias, it isn't worse. Come on, lad. We need to get you to your father. I'll carry you. The rest of the way. Holy hell. Oh shit. Soldiers! The enemy advances! Hold the line! Yes, sir. They're not gonna hold the line. Ah. Uh, okay.
Hold on, Jillian. Almost there. Frank. The enemy's on the bridge. Wait. Is that Julian? Well, that'll be fine. In time. But... We failed again. I'm sorry. They're just... Too strong. I'm sure you gave it your all. The trap wasn't finished. But let's hope it's enough to deter the Goins until our reinforcements arrive. Fire away, Commander! What's he doing? Sir, I gave the signal to the archers, but our fire arrows are not igniting the barrels. And it looks as if the enemy has begun dismantling our trap. Blasted rain. This was our last chance to hold them until our shops... <laughs> this was our last chance to hold them until our ships arrived. Commander, sound the retreat. We make for the capital. Matthias, have mercy on us all. Oh, what's he doing? Is he doing a self-sacrifice? Julian, I need you to... to give this to my son. Can you do that for me? Hand it over, ruby ring. Oh, no. Uh, okay, but... can't you just give it to him yourself? <laughs> Frank, what are you doing? What I always do, Yan. Bail you out of... Unwinnable situations. Frank, stop! We've lost too many already! I order you to return at once, Captain! Sorry, old friend. Not this time. Frank! Damn it! Oh, now he's, he's all fast again. Uh-oh. Damn it! It's you! Human still alive. Impressed. This time, maybe break skull. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> what am I gonna do? I'm just gonna get crushed. <laughs> oh, literally, he's gonna crush me. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh. Go. Crush rest humans. Oh. Oh, I can move. Not yet. It's not over yet. What? Humans still alive? I just let that guy walk around on the bridge himself. He'll blow it up on his own with his own heavy ass footsteps. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, we're going even slower now. Why do you still move? Stop him now. Too late. Take this, you son of a bitch. Oh, yeah. Kind of sucks that I really like that character and he's dead now. Oh, that's kind of neat. The, the way he's sort of penciled in there, I guess that means he's dead. This is for you, my son. For you to grow up. For you to live your life. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, stupid mouse cursor. Holy crap. I'm in. I'm invested. I am fully on board with this game. If you continue that sort of story, that level of storytelling and uh, atmosphere creation, the, the music, if it's that good throughout, I am fully, fully on board and I will be a great big fan of this.
And I can't wait to uh, I can't wait to play the full version of it. The only crappy thing is I gotta wait a year because this comes out in late 2025. That hurts, but uh, I'll have to be patient.